So I've uh, started a second uh, blend uh, using stale gasoline as the solvent for waste vegetable oil. And uh, no, I think this might be the third, <laughs> the third experiment. The first experiment was just stale gasoline at 50, uh, probably at 50% with waste vegetable oil at 50%. And the waste gas, uh, the stale gasoline wouldn't even go into the vegetable oil. So the second experiment, which was last week, I uh, put, uh, I blended uh, waste gasoline but that's fairly fresh with the stale gasoline, which is very old, at 50%. And then I blended that with the vegetable oil. And about 10, 15% of the vegetable oil went into solution with the blend of stale gasoline and gasoline. So then uh, I started thinking about E85 and, and the symptoms here. In fact, I'm gonna, before I get there, I'm going to show you my sight glass used to be straight and it's now like spaghetti uh, and it's curvy and so every time I put the stale gas in here this hose gets weaker and uh, stretches out more I'm afraid the hose is going to burst any minute and uh, uh, so it's something in the stale gas what typically is in solvents that makes vinyl hose act like this is alcohol and so I was uh, thinking about E85, which is alcohol, 85% alcohol that's used as gasoline in engines. And normally ga alcohol will not blend with uh, gasoline. Uh, so uh, they have to do something, you know, put a co-solvent into the, into the e uh, ethanol to make it blend into gasoline so people can uh, who want to run E85 will be able to run regular gasoline as well. So they can put regular gasoline in their fuel tank and then put some E85 on, run it for a while, and then maybe they're in a part of town they can't find E85, so they go back to gasoline. And uh, so that co-solvent uh, is, I believe, acetone. Acetone is the most uh, common co-solvent. And so probably 15% of E85 is acetone. There's probably no gasoline in it at all. It's just acetone and, and alcohol. So running on that premise, I added a gallon of uh, acetone to my blend with, uh, so it's a blend of waste gasoline uh, at about 15%. Uh, it's 5% uh, acetone, 25% uh, stale gasoline, and 50% vegetable oil. And what we're going to do is look at today to see if uh, all the vegetable oil went into solution with the, with the stale gasoline and the alcohol and the acetone, or whether uh, some percentage of the vegetable oil did not go into solution. Our, okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to drain off a sample of the bottom oil from the blend of uh, stale gasoline, acetone, and waste vegetable oil. And I'm going to use a valve that I have at the bottom of the tank. I'm going to start draining off some of the oil. And what I'm looking for, first of all, is dark fluid, which will be, and see, you can see that it came out, started coming out dark right off the bat with some chunks in it. And let's see if I can give you a closer look at that. So it's got some got some chunks in it, which is to be expected. Uh, and this was, by the way, screened. Uh, okay, so now let's uh, take some more out. I can also tell that the oil is pretty thick. With all that solvent in it, it should be a lot thinner than it is. More big chunks came out. But it's still pretty thick. So I can tell that it's not, the oil is still not blending well with the stale gasoline, gasoline and acetone. So that tells me I have to add more acetone. 